Facility speedrun, here we go. After carefully exiting Megatron's colonoscopy, you run out of the restroom like Peter Griffin was just in there. Dash down the stairs while firing aimlessly at the floor and eventually murder this innocent guard who was just doing his job. Blast your way into the poorly protected security room and hit the switch. You know, this feels more like a brazen robbery than a mission for a secret agent. Seriously, it takes balls to run guns blazing through a chemical plant like this. Don't you think? Pass the lockers and open the next door through the halls of bitterness where three speedrun community geeks shoot at you for having fun with their favorite gaming category. I mean, how dare you? I'll tell you how, because I can, and watching you squirm over it is entertaining. More on your way to the back, you convince one complete simpleton to let you into the most important area of the facility, and all hell breaks loose. Now they're really coming for you as you've disturbed the natural order of things in a chemical plant, and they want to rectify your intrusion. Moving along, you ignore the other unfortunately imprisoned scientists and encounter Dr. Doak who wants a kiss for helping you out, but you don't comply because you're Bond and that's not your style. Silence the two remaining speedrun dorks and take a second to reach for the calculator on your watch since you'll need it to determine how many people are going to like this video. Hint, hint. Activate the door decoder and calmly wait as dozens of enemies rush their way to your location. Access is finally granted to the military's industrial septic tank room where you have a smelly rendezvous with Lord Eddard Stark of Winterfell. You both plot to blow the tanks and release the intoxicating aroma of creamy compiled commando crap. As he rambles and babbles on that winter is coming, you feel he's boring the hell out of you so you press the detonator. The stench becomes ridiculous so you save yourself with some clean fresh air. He got away, sir.